He gets one song where we say Yoruba people they sing. If they are belay, they sweet them. And then they're happy with people who surround them. They go talk, say, Oremo Warewa, Oremo Warewa, Congratulations, Oremo Warewa. That one means, say, Congratulations, my friend. Bring your hand, make I shake him. And now, person, when we say, Do well, you go shake him, say, Well done. Now, person, when we say, Your belly is sweet for, you go shake, say, Congratulations. And now they congratulate everybody. When be citizen of our great country, Nigeria. And the reason why they congratulate everybody will be Nigeria and I say, from today, May 29, 2019, we don't start brand new dispensation or administration inside Obodo, Nigeria. That's not because of say, if we go by say, since May 29, 1999, after we do election every four, four years, new government go come, carry Bible or carry Quran, talk say, I pledge or I solemnly swear to serve the people of Nigeria and we will start new government today for inside the Eagle Square and across 29 states for Obodo, Nigeria. Public officials, that is, governors and the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, with the vice president and the deputy governors of these 29 states, they stand and they promise, they pledge to work for the people of the 29 states and also our great country, Nigeria. And when I go see say, the ginger went there, my voice. And I want to say it is special. The reason why this ginger is special now because of say, and now moving forward, now we do about. We know they think about what did not happen. We go learn our lessons and we go look towards a brighter future. And what we go do now? Now to carry waka, enter inside small break. When we go this break, come back. We're going to talk about those things where supposedly the mind of President Mohamed Buhari and in Vice President Professor Pastor Yemi Oshibajo and also the 29 governors when we say after the 2019 election, they enter. Some then do four years. Some don't complete their eight years. Now fresh people enter. Some get the opportunity to do another four years. We're going to discuss all the issues with my open visitor, Oga Ikeako. Ugo Chuku, man, where we say is Sabi book, where we we go talk the matter, and we also get special package. We go play on all the action when happen today for Igu Square. You know, say when they talk, say what's be and the voice of the people, and the voice of the street, just in case you know what I'm. We don't arrange them for you. Igu Street you for Bella. No going when they come and ask the accident. <laughs> Welcome back to Asire Hot. Before I go to the capital, I say this one is special. And we get Obonga visitor. We go join us to Chuk Mount inside everything we concern. What it happened across the 29 states and also for the federal capital territory today. Ogai Kiako Oguchuku, welcome to Asire Hot. Thank you for uh, having me. Uh, no waste. I'm just go straight into the matter when we say uh, we can't come. If we begin to discuss now, say, how you go take rate the government or government if we classify all of them together? For the last four years, it will be like, say, we they go back and uh, what we don't discuss during the campaigns and immediately after elections. Now, now moving forward, we don't get new dispensation. And uh, that flag of Nigeria and the flag of defense, they don't raise and down. On Sunday, they bring and down. They can't give, uh, they submit that one, call a new one, raise them up to signal, say, uh, a new beginning. But some people, they look, say, moving forward, uh, on that president, he gets some things where supposed they're very, very important to run. Maybe we start with those three things when you use campaign for 2015. Because people they talk say government exists in continuum and are essentially about consolidation. Then maybe we just narrow them down to the economy, uh, security, and the war against corruption. It just like say these three things safe. Now see the things when we say now issues for Bodo Nigeria today. Maybe we start with one very, very important one, security, because some states uh, they've been talk say uh, everything when they go do they low key because they won't try and make everybody day safe. What do you think Sogar President is supposed to do as they concern security for Bodo Nigeria moving forward? Uh, as it be, if you look the whole as Matabi today, uh, mm. the mood where they the nation, it they very flat. Mm. Everybody just they one kind, one kind, one kind. If you watch as the inauguration take happen for Ukraine, what will happen? No two day, like some weeks back. You see, say the whole nation they ginger. Like everybody happy say with they, with they get new government. So as it be, uh, that mood they show say okay, what do people expect for the class of 20, 2015? That uh, the governors and the president of 2015, those class, they're not doing well. Mm. As we don't start new year, new uh, dispensation until today matter. First of all, the president need to understand say security you know they work well. 
Because if he continue to deny the reality, say uh, things they go well, and they blame my IG for waiting in talk for the interview when get with NTA a uh, uh, few hours ago. You need to understand say things do they move well. Now the only time we go feel begin the okay, who will feel remove, who will feel put, who will feel do this job, and most importantly himself suppose put body for the matter because it be like this now. The IG himself, the report to Ram. The mm -hmm. commissioners of police, they report to the IG where they report to Ram. So mm -hmm. we need to know who they do their work for each state. Person mm -hmm. who knows the they do, come mm -hmm. That's number one. Then number two, they need to get with what they call bad door channel. Maybe we start to have some kind of uh, uh, discussion and communication with some people. We say, now then they call this Wahala. Mm -hmm. Five or two go do them. Five or two take take some matter because as it be like this now, from uh, the north down to the east, down to the west, security not too balanced. Well, mm -hmm. people know they get mind come out again. Say they want to go enjoy themselves or say they want to travel because as they come out, you carry your chest for hand, say something fee happen. So most importantly, he said suppose talk some kind to say we can make the country feel all right. But you're not talking today. Some people they say inauguration because. Uh, June 12, maybe say there. So be, uh, today, we'll be saying, suppose, tell the country, say, okay, ah, everybody, no versatility is not to go where the other time. We know some people to do, but now we we'll do it well. Now, we're doing it for the one year. And mm. if you know if you talk now, so everybody look like, say, okay, we, we, we have one thing go for here. So for me, what you supposed to do now, now, be say, first of all, make the IG understand, say, security is not the most important thing for me at this mm -hmm. point. Mm -hmm. Anybody, any place where we all say issues there. Enter there, solve the matter, make the people feel safe and secure. And mm. if not, if you like, the, the IG talked the other time when you go to National Assembly, say they need uh, manpower, they need resources, make all those things that are available for them. If you guys will take, take uh, arrange all those things quickly, quick, make the get and make the fees and work. Because if not, Wahala goes still there as a day for some kind mm. places. Uh, make we leave security, enter another very, very important one. You don't talk them straight, say, now for our president, we'll be president and commander in chief of the armed forces to just give the order. And make sure saying follow through and well, we they see action. Make we enter another very, very important one, the economy of Nigeria. Uh, before May 29, it gets some people when don't talk. For example, somebody when we say no, suppose they talk. <laughs> the governor of Zamfara, outgoing in gone governor of Zamfara. When by 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 I don't want to say by the grace of God, <laughs> make it not be like say, I wish I'm evil. Uh, by their own mistake, in order to go Senate too. Because Supreme Court don't talk, say, make INEC collect the certificate of return, give it to the people who carry second for that election. So, in being talk, say, hey, he, the way when they check him out, with in governor wisdom, hey, or in former governor wisdom, because you know, get them again, in former governor wisdom, say, by 2021, Nigeria will face recession. And you never to take again. The governor of the central bank, uh, as soon as they give a second term, he been talking say the road when they are ahead of us is rough and tough. So people don't hear these things. They talk say hey, this one where people they say road ahead of us, uh, the way when things take day. What do you think say Nigeria supposed to expect for the next four years? Should I say we close our minds, say no hope, say not die with it? And what do you president of do? To use restore the confidence of the Nigerian people. I tell them say government they work to see say our economy he balance and he de kajad. My name is Jeremiah. If I talk, say one bad thing, I be like, say, I'm a prophet of doom. Say, the mm. third country say, you no know, go work. Mm. But the thing we say, as the economy will be, our economy will be today, get K-Leg. Mm. Right? Uh, for this morning, Force Magazine can't write one kind of small post. Say, if you want to invest money, lose them for market, for Africa, invest for Nigeria. Hey. So, as it be like this, the investors themselves no got confidence for Nigeria market. You see, as they take, they get one kind of small wahala with some one kind of big telecommunication company for Nigeria, and all these things where they happen, we say investors they look at. If the market no day favorable to them, capital this money what they see in a flight, they could just move enter one kind one uh, under uh, under country when need the pass us. So the thing first of all, we say, Mr. President, need to calm down. He need to believe in what they call free market. Because if you believe him, he go do some kind of policy where they say, we're going to make people, we're going to make investors get confidence to put money inside this economy. Because if investors don't put money inside this economy, we don't feel building industries. Hmm. We don't feel get people who go feel employ some uh, person for jobs. So now it be the most important thing. And as it be for the last four years, we still say when some companies, they come out, they tell us that corrupt money, they make them, they come out, they make them, they pursue. As they come out, jobs, they come out to them. Hmm. Because... As a person close shop, say don't do it again. He don't close. All those two people where they work with time, sales girl, assistant, all those ones, they don't go get job again. Mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. those ones don't enter into what they call labor market. So as it be like this, uh, Forbes, everybody don't talk, say Nigeria economy get killed. Like. Hmm. I'm not be like, what in a, a bit, my, my issue be say, CBN governor, where they give job, you don't suppose they tell us, you're not supposed to give us story. Mm -hmm. We don't give you job, maybe because they tell us that things go bad. Mm -hmm. If things go bad, now they come out, maybe find person go help us make things make good. Go repair them. Make it repair them because I believe it because so it depends me say they give that guy, may continue. Mm -hmm. Because if President just give you job, say oh boy, come do this thing for me, corona for me. Now they can't give you the job. First, the way they tell the country where we help you, may take get the job, say things go bad. Mm -hmm. Not be waiting we want. So the thing is say, 
As it be like this now, eh? President only keep weak. You know, last time, I think it was last time, 2015, mm. it takes six months. I personally get belay, I won't go deliver. Mm. Can't take, get ministers, can't get. So now, now, we suppose no, over the next uh, few days when they come, or a few weeks when they come, who could be the minister of finance, mm. minister of investment? We need people where Sabi they work, mm. not the people where we say they know nothing that they do. Mm. If you get those people for this kind, put what they call square peg for square holes. Those people feel no thing they go do. We're going to make Oyibo, make people be investors. This okay. Our market is favorable. If we put our money here, government don't go use one kind of law overnight, take uh, scatter everything for us. So now what will be they do this kind of thing? Should say our market is favorable to investment. So say if person invest money here, if businessman carry money from China or from anywhere come inside this place, he go reap benefit. If you feel do that thing, feel feel uh, a, a, a shop investor say everything do all right, they go come. And what the president need to do, and all these kind, uh, all these kind of travel that they travel now, you need to go to, 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 to some kind of places, some kind of country. Be say, go Middle East, go China. I show the investors so they bring money come Nigeria, mm -hmm. enter Europe. Then they say, see, Nigeria the favorable ground. Mm -hmm. They make sure say the reality is ready for ground. Maybe say if they come here, maybe say they come here, maybe they come plenty while a day for them. We don't say we don't get power. We don't say we don't get some money. Say. But all these kind of things, we say in the short term, you need to assure people where they bring this thing. Say, you go give them the confidence. Confidence when they come. Say, then you are when they take uh, start this uh, praise. I'm oh, sorry, worship. Yeah. You no, know, say I worship. Then they start first. You are when they take start this worship. By the time when they enter praise, now, so Holy Spirit go come down. Thing, say, they need to stop to the me yeah, they call and we chant. Because, for example, now we get Wala, they get the Nigeria government get Wala with one of the big telecommunication companies. Mm. And as it be like, they make no call their name. But as it be like this, this company, they get friends all over the world. Mm -hmm. the, or you both they look, people they look, investors they look, they see how you take they manage this situation. If you don't think manage situation like this, well, well, how person go one can collect billions, uh, millions, can invest in the economy? You know, if you say, even if a uh, company don't do it what you like, you get as they take they manage something. You know, we can't go, be, uh, they say, not be the day where I pick in, uh, throw away water, like they throw arm. You guys go take manage the whole. So if you manage and wear, not make investors of you come, and when they come, they will bring money come our economy. Mm. And when they bring money come our economy, if we employ people, if we invest for some kind of places, and the only way forward. And Mr. President, don't need to start today, do and today, today. Mm. No time when they begin to do uh, uh, dinner, all those kind of things for Abuja, we will not get that time. As it be like this, economy get careless, like work. And now work, now go they, they the This night, this night, when they start work. Make the legs straight. Make we go ahead and very, very important one, the war against corruption. President Mohamed Bouhari been talking for 2015. He not talk anything this 2019, but some people, they calculate, say maybe now June 12th, uh, maybe no one waste the talk. <laughs> so maybe June 12th. But talk, talk not the finish. Uh, talk not the finish, but you know, say, <laughs> well, just as an elderly person. <laughs> so uh, maybe the talk feel heavier for math. We'll make your talk at once. Uh, but the war against corruption, uh, since 2015, people don't get different definition for them. And some people, once you talk war against corruption, now different things, they come their mind. Uh, we know, say, this thing, a bad thing when they happen inside our society. And uh, the cause of the uh, backwardness when this country day. Because if we talk about all the big, big money, all the plenty money, when we're supposed to put it to education, healthcare, infrastructure, and the rest of them, uh, we will not see and put, and it end up for some people's pockets. Uh, the investment when we're supposed to get, we know they get up. Human capital development, we were supposed to see, we know they see up. And now why be say, Nigeria, they underdeveloped. Uh, unemployment, that's something where we say, if they carry first. Anger, they, frustration, people, they embrace crime, and the rest of them. We we'll talk about this war against corruption, starting first from the angle of, say, it be like saying that only people when they under umbrella or somewhere else, now then they follow. And those where hope room, they be sent. How we go take it, get uh, arrangement where we say, when we talk about the war against corruption, every Nigerian will get confident. Uh, say, whether you did this party or you did that party, oh, if you do this thing, you go answer your money. I get the talk for Bible, make I use and take explain this mm. thing. They say, uh, say judgment go start for house of God. Mm. The only way where we say this country will not say president this just corruption matter, mm. it got start from people within your house. Mm. For example, for my SG, uh, SGF, Babachi Lawa, he did a chill, he did a laugh, he did a enjoy himself, he did a walk up and that. Mm. But this man won't know say. You don't move money where they're supposed to use take help IDBs for uh, not East. Nobody do them anything. Mm. It, ta it take time before they come out and from a uh, SGA position. We'll see the thing will happen for Nema, the money where they embezzle for Nema and all this kind of thing. So the thing we say, all these people will do all these things, they still there inside APC. Mm. They see they work, some of them see they work with President. Some of them see they work out free. So President talks and goes, uh, uh, help Nigeria take a uh, fixed corruption matter for 2015. Mm -hmm. If you ask me, truth, we know do one. Because mm. if say do one, Babaji is now supposed they could uh, create or say they could prison for Abuja, mm. they enjoy fresh air. But as far as they say they work, they fulfill everybody, just they, uh, they jubilate, they're happy, you know, do the work. And the only way where we say him talk, not me to talk, 
Easy to go go arrest uh, opposition or arrest person where you say you no know, too like or say person where they talk in mind against you. That was normal. But when we go not say in serious what you need to talk. Mm. Even if the people come enter your party, they don't carry broom, they don't turn sin. As far as they get corruption charges against them, mm. make EFCs to do their work. May they may they find them, may they prosecute them, and if they find them guilty, carry them enter Kligri or carry them enter Kuje. That's the only thing. Mm. As far as they get people like Babachi Lawa. The waka people where they involved for the Neymar corruption case, the waka that means even a uh, uh, president's wife in ADC uh, common money the other time. All this is happening under your administration. So, if all these people where we're talking now say all of them they're free, they like sent, they don't do anything again. Mm. And president, they tell us say corruption, corruption, this corruption, that that talk no, you know, enter where well. Mm. So, for him to face this corruption this time, if to, to say one do him, he say, make him look inward. Mm -hmm. He gets some people will be saying that former governors will get corruption cases with FCC. Mm -hmm. They don't cry, they don't move from this party, enter in party. Mm -hmm. Everyone don't forget this. EFCC don't, don't forget their fight. Let's say their fight, their doors don't catch them, they don't see them again. Mm -hmm. All those ones make the authorities already involved. May they begin to fish them out, begin to deal with them small, small. Now, the only way, now the time where you do all these things, now we're going to say they stress of uh, fiscal corruption. If you not do them, I joke, you joke with us. Now, maybe we can't talk about uh, our governors then. And uh, we get 36 inside of Bodo, Nigeria. Even though some people there, they do their own election for off season. Like this year, later this year, we will get Kogi and also Baesa State. Uh, the state government, a level of government, just like the federal and the local government. And they get plenty of responsibility. In fact, if all the 36 states, when they start Bodo, Nigeria, when we say based on the arrangement, oh, they ensure say local government, 774 of them, they work well. Our country is supposed to not turn to land of milk and honey. Uh, but people like say somehow, somehow, uh, plenty, not they really do their work. I would like we could just give word of encouragement, not be to the governors them, because we, we know them that they are way. The people when they inside the states and the people of Nigeria in general, on how from today now, when we May 29, when the government just starts, if we go by the calculation, oh, they go begin they ask the right questions, they hold government accountable and begin they speak with one voice. So that those waiting for government gonna say moving forward is no longer going to be business as usual. As, as it be like this, uh, we see as the election take go, some governors will suppose win their state, they lose their state. Mm. Even some will suppose maybe they don't bring that person, say, okay, this one, or maybe this person replace me, based on say, maybe they're my person, they're my guy. If you enter there, me, I go still do okay. They lose. So as the, some states say, or your state, Imo state, for example, Rochas lose uh, in son in law Even Bauchi. Even Bauchi. So some mm. kind of place, even uh, for your state, it happened. Mm -hmm. uh, so the thing is, the people of this state need to ask themselves questions. Mm. Well, for example, now, new government don't enter. Some people be like, say, my brother don't enter. Person from our local government or our senator zone don't enter. Time. Now our time. Now our time. Now our that our time language, we will kill them. Hmm. We need to delete them from our language. Nothing be your time. Hmm. For example, if not about you people, not about you people time. Hmm. If not uh, Edo people, now everybody time. Not be one, not be saying that one local government or one uh, senator district. And then they begin to ask questions. Because if you not ask government, governor question from day one, okay, okay, I said, don't swear at me today. Next tomorrow, you go see for church. Mm. Everybody, they're happy. They clap. What do they clap hand for? Next question, we say, oh, God, what do they do for us? Mm. School, when, children will never go to school. How you tell they fix them? Mm. Uh, road, we know they. How you tell they fix them? Now, the question, we're not supposed to ask them. If governor enter for uh, maybe radio radio uh, program or radio event for with state, no call and they tell and say, uh, uh, governor, now be the best in after slice bread. Mm. You don't chop bread, keep bread. Ask them question. Like I said, student, they house. Uh, workers know they get their salary. Pensioners know they chop their money. What is happen? How you want to face this question? Now, when we begin to ask a serious question, now they're going to say things go happen because the thing is, all these governors, they don't use feedback, they work. Because if people were there with them, and if people were there, they govern, the followership, because they tell them and say, ah, everything, they're fine. Uh, your SNMC, Tualesa, Tualema, all those kind of things. They're not going to do anything. So the thing is, as followers, our task from this moment now, now, be say, anywhere where you see on social media, all the platform where you get, where if you get access to the governor, the people where they work with them, they ask them questions, say, this thing they never do them. Mm. You don't give us your, uh, the campaign, during the campaign uh, season, you give us manifesto, what you go do mm. within four years. Begin to check out, what the governor saying go do within the next three months. Mm -hmm. Time don't start. In next three months, check whether the governor don't do them. Mm. Next six months, check whether they don't do them. One year, what we say they want to do one year in office, they get a cut cake, they spend governor, uh, people money anyhow. Say, oh, guy, you don't do this thing. And the person not do them. Next four years, make it they go back in village. Hmm. Next four years, make the person they go back in village. This one now really shows, say, now our hand, now in the power day as Nigerians. I like the way when we say this conversation, they go. Make I can talk one very, very important one now. Uh, we know, say, as governors, ah, governors. Who receive visit of these governors? Ademo. From pastor, from imam, even those when we say they do their own for midnight inside bush, student union, market women, promotional interest group, labor, all of them, your excellency, your excellency. No kind of visitor when we say governor, no, they receive, except one, because then they for office that time. 
Uh, but for now, you get the kind of visitors when we say ex governors, them will begin to receive those people. They wear red waistcoats, uh, they write EFCC for the back of their clothes. <laughs> Some governors now, uh, like Ogaro Chasukrocha, we've been here and say Justice Taiwo Taiwo, uh, been give uh, stay, say make EFCC, and all do the investigation when we say they won't investigate. Even the one we concerned, Dr. Bukola Saraki, he goes to be doctor, but he don't go be senior president, he do not be former. They also talk, say, make to stop the investigation. And uh, it comes like, say, somehow, somehow, uh, we go begin to experience something where we always be experience after new government just enter. Uh, hey, they are following me because, they are following me because, and we go come where I should, we come begin to follow them. I would like me to stress the importance of investigation so that when public officials finish in term for office, whether not this party, that party, whether not I go church pass, whether not I go mosque pass, we must check the book. To so know, say, we hold you accountable because the office where you did, now we put you, the work where you do, now what you do and for the money where you use, now what money you spend, emphasize on the importance of that one. The, the thing is, say, uh, investigation, they proper, and it's necessary for democracy to thrive. Hmm. So as it be like this, if you say now Rochas, if you say now uh, Saraki, if you say now uh, uh, Amosue just finished from Oguse, because some of them, they go, they go enter Senate. Come there, they are just the say I and A. The thing we say, anybody will be said finish. EFCC if he say they get legitimate case against them. Where they carry them go court because at the end of the day, the whole matter be say if the if the person if EFCC go court win the case, that means that the person go earn tap ram because that means the person don't chop money where they supposed to use the uh, uh, developing state or supposed to use the helping people. So don't be bad in say EFCC they not for your door. Say governor, you don't finish. Okay? As you don't finish now, come give us tell, come tell us what you do with the money where, where, where your people give you. Mm. Now, now the normal thing, now so democracy take the for sure. So if you have to say they get case with all the governors, eh? Make them begin to ask them question. Okay, how how, how this one take happen? What do you do this one? And make those ones, make them not come use the thing we say sometimes they use law. Take uh, Mago Mago their way, say, out, come, they, come, come, come on for the matter. If you don't fear anything, you don't need to go, go, collect court injunction, make EFCC not look inside their book. Mm. If you have not say your hand, they clean. Allow EFCC, make EFCC come do their job. Mm. Maybe they tell us what they'll find. And EFCC, as MB, if they get governors where they know, say, okay, this governor, will they get evidence, say, you don't overspend money or you spend money for some things where you're supposed to spend money? Maybe they go on with them. All mm. these things, they're necessary for our democracy to try. Because if all these things they happen, let me say, EFCC, they do their job. Mm. All the checks and balances, all these things where they're supposed to do, the prosecution and rest of them, they do their job. Then my wife be say, EFCC, they a big bongo case. Mm. We go talk. Because, for example, now, uh, when we see the case of uh, uh, Ibori, mm. when the FCC they charge Ibori, let's say they can't charge it, which 100. Mm. How you want to take nail one person for 100 can't charge it? Mm. You be which? But when they enter UK, they say, now four, now four, now four, now four, they take Naka. After they do their investigation, now four, they take Naka. You know, escape. You know, escape. So the thing is, say, make the FCC learn how they do the work. If you know what, go abroad. Say, I say, I think they do them. Go for the way you don't spend money, don't do some kind of thing. One court, they give 100 count charges. I want to prove them from which kind of court. Time, no, the judge has got other things to do. So the thing is, say, make them look at the best case where we say they're possible. Then ask question. If evidence is there, and after all reasonable data, I say, they talk for court, this person, they're guilty. They prosecute them, and make the court decide. Say, okay, this person enter jail because say you thief money. But EFCC they're supposed to do their work, and all these governors make they accept them. Oga go to The way we say you don't answer this question, saying that something we say they give me joy, and I go like make our people when they for house, uh, they just sit back, relax, and enjoy uh, highlights of the action when happened today inside the Igu Square for Abuja. The reason why they carry this one come now so that Nigerians go to feel say then they're part of this process. And from today, we will start from today, begin to ask the right questions. Uh, now you get this handshake because we go follow from this video now. We will go balance the watch up, make we also enjoy them. And we now go see the better, better things what they happen for inside all this kind of ceremony. When they go bring the flag down, go give them, they go collect new one, raise them to signify say new dispensation or new administration don't start. Or God president don't sign. Or God Yemi Oshiba don't sign. Even though some people don't talk, say the Bible and Quran when they use swear. <laughs> some people don't say when they use Amadioha. <laughs> now when some people don't go, <laughs> but maybe we just enjoy this better package. So uh, we will continue the discussion based on say as we don't talk, oh, uh, we warm. Maybe we they ask the right questions and they follow everything where we need to follow. I see the heart. Maybe we enjoy. military officers, both serving and retired, most distinguished invited guests, ladies and gentlemen, to the far left of the presidential days, we can see the presidential limo sandwiched by the bagpipers, inching steadily and slowly towards uh, the presidential days. 
climaxing the arrival of dignitaries for this epoch making and most significant occasion of the 2019 presidential inauguration ceremony. Please, once again, when we announce the arrival of Mr. President, in absolute deference to his exalted offices and his most distinguished personage, we are expected to rise, please. Please, thank you. Special guest of honor, the reviewing officer, President, Commander in Chief of the Armed Forces of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, His Excellency Muhammad Buhari, Grand Commander of the Order of the Federal Republic, just been received there by the Commander Guards Brigade. He is accompanied by High Excellency Ajia Muhammad Buhari. His Excellency exchanges pleasantries with the Vice President, the Senate President, the Speaker House of Representatives, His Honorable Lordship Chief Justice, the Chief of Defense Staff, Chief of Army Staff, Chief of the Air Staff, and the Inspector General of Police, also there, the Chief of the Naval Staff, and of course uh, the Chairman of uh, the Action Progressives Congress. You now move to the saluting days for the presidential salute, please. Seated, please. Officers, warrant officers in uniform should salute. Thank you. Thank you. So you repeat after me. I, I, Yemi Obasa Osimbajo, Yemi Osimbajo, do solemnly swear, do solemnly swear that I will be faithful, that I will be faithful. And bear true allegiance. And bear true allegiance to the Federal Republic of Nigeria. To the Federal Republic of Nigeria. And that I will preserve. And that I will preserve. Protect. Protect. And defend the Constitution. And defend the Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. So help me God. So help me God. Yemi Oshimbajo. Yemi Oshimbajo. Do solemnly swear. 
do solemnly swear that I will be faithful that I will be faithful and bear true allegiance and bear true allegiance to the Federal Republic of Nigeria to the Federal Republic of Nigeria that as Vice President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria that as Vice President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria I will discharge my duties <laughs> I will discharge my duties to the best of my ability to the best of my ability faithfully faithfully and in accordance and in accordance with the constitution with the constitution of the federal republic of nigeria and the law of the federal republic of nigeria and the law and always and always in the interest in the interest of the sovereignty of the sovereignty integrity integrity solidarity solidarity well-being well-being and the prosperity and prosperity of the federal republic of nigeria of the federal republic of that, nigeria that i will strive that i will strive to of uh, uh, preserve to preserve the fundamental objectives the fundamental objectives and directives of principles of state policy and directive principles of state policy contained in the constitution contained in the constitution of the federal republic of nigeria of the federal republic of nigeria that i will not allow that i will not allow my personal interest my personal interest to influence to influence my official conduct my official conduct my official decisions my official decisions that i will to the best of my ability that i will to the best of my ability preserve preserve protect protect and defend the constitution and defend the constitution of the federal republic of nigeria of the federal republic of nigeria that i will abide that i will abide by the code of conduct by the code of conduct contained in the fifth schedule contained in the fifth schedule to the constitution to the constitution of the federal republic of nigeria of the federal republic of nigeria that in all circumstances that in all circumstances i will do right i will do right to all manner of people to all manner of people according to law according to law without fear without fear or favor or favor affection or a, ill will affection or ill will that i will not directly or indirectly that i will not directly or indirectly communicate communicate or reveal to or any re person or reveal to any person any matter any matter which shall be brought under my consideration which shall be brought under my consideration or shall become known to me or shall become known to me as vice president of the federal republic of nigeria as vice president of the federal republic of nigeria except as may be required except as may be required for the due discharge for of the my due, duties for the due discharge of my duties as vice president as vice president so help me god so help me god Buhari, Muhammad Buhari, do solemnly swear, do solemnly swear that I will be faithful, that I will be faithful and bear true allegiance, and bear true allegiance to the Federal Republic of Nigeria, to the Federal Republic of Nigeria, and that I will preserve, and that I will preserve, protect, protect defend the constitution of the federal republic of nigeria and defend the constitution of the federal republic of nigeria so help me god so help me god also 
of office of president. I, I, Muhammadu Buhari, Muhammadu Buhari, do solemnly swear, do solemnly swear that I will be faithful, that I will be faithful and bear true allegiance, and bear true allegiance to the Federal Republic of Nigeria, to the Federal Republic of Nigeria, that as president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria that as president of the federal republic of nigeria i will discharge my duties i will discharge my duties to the best of my ability to the best of my ability faithfully faithfully and in accordance with the constitution of the federal republic of nigeria and in accordance with the constitution of the federal republic of nigeria and the law and the law and always and always in the interest of the sovereignty in the interest of sovereignty integrity integrity solidarity solidarity well-being well-being and prosperity and prosperity of the federal republic of nigeria of the federal republic of nigeria that i will strive that i will strive to preserve to preserve the fundamental objectives the fundamental objectives and directive principles of state policy and directive principles of state policy contained in the constitution contained in the constitution of the federal republic of nigeria of the federal republic of nigeria that i will not allow my personal interest that i will not allow my personal interest to influence my official conduct to influence my official conduct or my official decisions or my official decisions that i will to the best of my ability that i will to the best of my ability preserve preserve protect protect and defend the constitution of the federal republic of nigeria and defend the constitution of the federal republic of nigeria that i will abide that i will abide by the code of conduct by the code of conduct contained in the fifth schedule contained in the fifth schedule to the constitution of the federal republic of nigeria to the constitution of the federal republic of nigeria that in all circumstances that in all circumstances i will do right i will do right to all manner of people to all manner of people according to law according to law without fear or favor without fear or favor affection or ill will affection or ill will that i will not that i will not directly or indirectly directly or indirectly communicate communicate or reveal to any person or reveal to any person any matter any matter which shall be brought under my consideration which shall be brought under my consideration or shall become known to me or shall become known to me as president of the federal republic of nigeria as president of the federal republic of nigeria except as may be required except as may be required for due discharge or due discharge of my duties as president as my duties as president so help me god so help me god Chief of the Armed Forces, Federal Republic of Nigeria, President Muhammadu Buhari, GCFR. Most distinguished invited guests, senior officers, both serving and deservedly retired, captains of industries, members of the diplomatic corps, your royal highnesses, ladies and gentlemen. What we shall be witnessing next is the lowering 
of the national and defense flags, which is symbolic, signifying the end of our dispensation. When the national and defense flags are being lowered, please all are expected to rise. Officers and warrant officers in uniform are expected to salute. Shall we please rise for the ceremonial sunset? of defense staff from His Excellency, who in turn is marching back to hand over the national and defense flags that have been received from His Excellency to the Commander Guards Brigade. Flags handed over there to the Commander Guards Brigade, who in turn is marching steadily to hand over the national and defense flags that was received from His Excellency to Master Warrant Officer Adams Babidele. Flags received there from the Commander Guards Brigade. And what we are witnessing right now is the Regimental Sergeant Major about to hand over the national and defense flags to the flag bearers for onward hoisting, signifying the commencement of a new dispensation. Please, when the flags are being hoisted, all are expected to rise. Officers in uniform and master warrant officers are expected to salute. Immediately after the hoisting of the flags, there will be the 21 gun salute. Please do not panic at the sound of the artillery volleys when being sounded during the 21 gun salute. Shall we all rise? Officers and warrant officers in uniform are to please salute. Thank you.
shall we still remain standing for the 21 gun salute? National salute! Please and ice! Please, shall we all rise? Please take your seats. Thank you. The parade commander, Lieutenant Colonel MS Daruda, now marches forward to seek the presidential permission of Mr. President to march of the colors and the rest of the parade, bringing us to the end of this very significant milestone in the annals of our country, Nigeria. To march off the colors and the rest of the parade, Your Excellency. Presidential permission sought there and permission graciously granted by Mr. President. At this juncture, Your Excellencies, we've come to the end of this epoch making ceremony. We want to very sincerely appreciate. Uh, Your Excellencies, the dignitaries for honoring this invitation. A quick reminder here, uh, June 12, 2018, Democracy Day. Please, let's all be committed. So on behalf of the Secretary General, the Secretary to the Government of the Federation and Chairman of the National Planning Committee of the 2019 Presidential Inauguration Ceremony, Mr. Boss Mustafa, we want to say thank you once again, and God bless as you return to your respective destinations. God bless your excellencies. Thank you. Your announcers have been Iberi Young, MFR, my colleague, Captain Haruna Timothy Tagwai, the Assistant Director of Public Relations, Gas Brigade, and yours sincerely, Major Paul S. Abara, a retired officer formerly of the Directorate of Army Public Relations. Thank you, and God bless until we meet again June 12, by his grace. Thank you. To enjoy more of these our Ogunge videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.